Hi, I'm Tom Calabro, Director of Marketing and Product Development with Fujifilm's Optical Devices Division. If you're a professional videographer or cinematographer, you've likely been in a situation where your focus is sharp, but softens when you zoom in or zoom out. When this happens, your back focus needs adjusting. In order to properly make this adjustment, just follow these simple steps. By doing so, you may avoid focus issues down the road. To get started, place your camera and lens on a tripod or stable mount about 10 feet from a Siemens star or other focus chart. If you don't have a chart, use an object that has fine detail, such as a fence or a brick wall. If you are adjusting a wide angle lens, place it about six feet from the chart. And if you are adjusting an extreme tele lens, place it about 15 to 20 feet away. Now make sure the lens f-stop is wide open. This step is critical. If necessary, reduce the light. Use an ND filter or use the camera shutter so the chart is exposed to the nominal level. If it helps, you can increase the peaking on the viewfinder or monitor, but not too high. Turn the viewfinder or monitor contrast up and turn the brightness down. Now zoom in on your chart or subject full tight. Keep in mind that if your lens has a two times extender, you'll need to switch to one times. Adjust the lens focus control until you achieve optimal focus. Use the chart again for this. Then zoom out full wide. Next, loosen the back focus screw on the lens and rotate the ring until you get the best overall focus and the picture is nice and sharp. If you're using the Siemens star chart, it should pop, showing the best back focus as it reaches the optimal position. Now repeat the steps shown here two or three times to achieve the best result. Don't be tempted to do these steps just once. It may take a few times to get the back focus critical enough for HD. Once you've completed that, tighten the back focus screw, but make sure you don't over tighten it or you could dent the barrel. The distances behind a lens are critical, which is one of the reasons why this test should be at the top of your camera prep to-do list. If the lens is not focusing accurately, any other tests are meaningless, and you could wind up with unusable footage. If you follow these steps, you can rest assured that your lens will track focus throughout the zoom range, and you could move forward to the task at hand with confidence. For more information on Fujifilm optical devices, go to fujinon.com or fujifilmusa.com.